What's up guys, my name's Captain Dave and welcome back to Lego Marvel Super Heroes where last time we left off we had an assault on the raft and it's normally bad guys that assault the raft as they try to get out but I suppose in actual fact that was exactly what happened we went in there just trying to clean up the mess we managed to get a Abomination, the leader, Whiplash and Sabretooth in the process but then some of the bigger, the higher ups, basically the more important bad guys Managed to escape, and not only did they escape, they took my clothes with them, and <laughs> does not sit well with Iron Man. Nobody wants to see those pasty legs, so <laughs> let's be getting back to the mainland, and uh, let's go back to Stark Tower and get him some more appropriate clothing. Huh. And there was me for a second thinking I was going to be able to drive this boat, damn it. I hopped on the wrong boat. I should have hopped on that boat over there. I've got my own boat. I should really stop saying boat. <laughs> Plus, I don't really trust this guy. He looks like the sea captain from uh, <laughs> Titanic. We all know how that ended. Oh, thank you very much. Although, however, I do believe... Not that. I don't want that one. If I find one of those little shield access points, I might be able to travel uh, to Stark Tower in a little bit more style. And I know I said we're going to do in the uh on the wall. Do we have something that would fit it? Man, I miss flying. All this running is making me tired. How do people live like this? It's a burden we bear, I am. It's a burden we bear. But yeah, I know I said we're going to do any free roaming stuff until end game, but you know me, I just can't help myself sometimes. Ah, look at that, just like that, we've unlocked a vehicle. The vehicle, actually, <laughs> which is exactly the kind of thing that I wanted. Although, I don't think I can get up there unless I have a, uh, a flying character. No, I don't think I can. That's a kind of a pain in the took us. I stand corrected! <laughs> I knew there had to be a way up there for us standing running characters. I mean, why would they make Captain America be able to open it, but then Captain America not be able to get it? The shield AP... APC. God, my basic English language failed me then for a second. Oh, if only I could have glided over there. Oh, don't worry, there's one right here. It's exactly the sort of thing I was looking for. Now, normally when you're free roaming around the city, you can just hold Y or Triangle if you're on PlayStation and um, just flick between your characters that way. Although, if you want to do it while you're playing the main game like this, I believe this is the only way of doing it. I thought you could uh, switch by holding Y or Triangle at any point, but... No point of switching characters just yet. All we want right now is to get us a vehicle. Something to get us there in style. A school bus definitely does sound like fun. A saloon car, a small car, a damn police car. Standard civil servant vehicles. Hey, look at that. We even got a pedal bike. <laughs> News van, tanker, taxi. No, no, no. If we're going to get there, we're going to go there in style. So what do we pick? Do we go with the cloud rider or the spider buggy? Hmm. As much as I want to go in the spider buggy, I think I'm going to go with Cloud Rider on this one. Cloud Rider it is! Normally I love all things spider, but this thing just has a unique little hover ability that <laughs> I, don't, I, just, I just like. Sorry if it hovers, it kind of beats out everything else. Iron Man, you might um, you might have to walk your way there. Um, that's, you got no armor, you're, you're practically useless. <laughs> Sorry buddy. How is it you make this thing hover again? There we are! <laughs> L1 on the left bumper. You can just hover over the competition. Yes, I am quite amazing, thank you. Oh no, there's a car in my way! Well, I'll just hover right over that bad boy. Lead the way, invisible blue dude. Lead the way. Yikes! Oh, that a cheap shot. <laughs> What's pretty small? You better not be uh, insulting Captain America. I'm too busy hovering to notice. Wow, this is embarrassing. I left my keys in my other suit. Is there another way to open it? Sure. We just need to think outside the box a little. 
Yeah, well, if you'd left them in the other suit, I'm sure they would have been stolen along with this suit. Oh, I see the Captain America thing under there. Don't think I... Don't! <laughs> it's a stark style. Everything must go. Quite nice of you, Iron Man, to install the Captain America opening device there. I guess you really do think of everything. Hokity pokity, right, we do not want it there, we want that one to go down there, we want that one to go straight up, and this one to go left. Open says me! Stark Tower dominates the Manhattan skyline as either a highly advanced technological research facility or a giant monument to its owner's ego. Depends who you ask. Did I ever tell you about my party armor? It was designed like a tuxedo for more formal battles. Honey, I'm home. What's with the hostile welcome? Jarvis. It's me. Your boss, man? Intruder alert. Security activated. Intruders? Jarvis, Security Override Command Tango, Oscar Sierra 3963. We're gonna have to fight our way in. Someone must have hacked my systems. That's the kind of thing I do to other people. What the... Jarvis has been hacked, and I can't trust my suits either. All of them? They're all connected to the mainframe. Except for one of them. Is there any way to turn off these lasers? No, not in full lockdown. I might be able to disrupt their pattern buffers, though. An interface terminal. One interface terminal coming right up. Man, it's like Stark's getting a taste of his own medicine. It's gonna be the Baxter building all over again, isn't it? Now to make this said terminal, Tony, unfortunately this will involve me destroying pretty much everything you own. Fair warning. Huh. It's like your equipment has a, <laughs> a little sturdier than I thought it was first going to be. Fair enough, round two. Round three. <laughs> I'll pick up all the little Lego bricks to boot as well. See, even if there wasn't a purpose for this, I think I'll just do it just to collect all the Lego bricks. Oh, why won't this machine just get destroyed? It's just one left. There we go, that's what I was looking for. See, Tony, you're not the only one who knows how to build things. Oh, I'm surprised though, Captain's just building a big American flag. There's one down, two down, everything comes in threes. That kind of did it. We can get past if we time it right. Didn't work out all the bugs in this system, did you there, Tony? Oh, looks like I have to get past this before I can destroy that. Although in saying that, that looks like it's something that uh, I have a Hawkeye Iron Man needs to destroy. Yeah, I don't think that is something I can destroy. Not yet, anyway. Yikes! Oh, that was close. Hey look, Cap's back to flex it as well. Hey Tony, look! I'm using your frickin' laser! <laughs> you 
Yeah, sorry for destroying all your equipment there, but I'm sure you have the funds to rebuild it. I need my key card to unlock the suit. And you don't have it. It's just over there, on the other side of that sealed door. Naturally. Alright, easy does it. Fred the needle. Fred the needle. Higher, higher. There we go. Come to Papa. Much better. A little old fashioned by my standards, but it should get the job done. A little old fashioned indeed. Adrian Kildridge. Looks like we've got the old extra. I never know how to say is it. Extrudemus? Extrudemus? Extrudermus? I never know how to say that, but. Yeah, this suit is very old indeed. Watch it try and fly. Can't quite fly. It's got a good hover ability going on, though. <laughs> oh, it's like the start of Iron Man 1 all over again. I'm ready for you. Welcome to the party, boys! <laughs> I think it was a good idea Adrian got out of there while he could. I mean, not for us, but for him it was. Give me your coins! I know they're Lego bricks, but... Coin pretty much sums up what they were. They're formed from molten lava. <laughs> ah, two Austin Powers references in one video. <laughs> Never would have thought Iron Man and Austin Powers would go hand in hand, but there you go. Radios, quick safety save. Well, we have a Red Skull style Jarvis looking at us. Oh, Stan, if we had the Sandman with me, I'd come help you, but. <laughs> Looks like that might have to wait. Ah, for a second there, I thought that little uh, box was going to be one of those collectibles you can get. Stop hitting my equipment. It's rude. Oh yeah, <laughs> I keep forgetting you can't fly. Instead of, instead of that, instead of running over here with Iron Man, I'm pretty certain I probably could have just switched to Cap instead, but... Alright Cap, you stay here, I'm gonna activate the switch, you can be the one who does all the uh, the manual labour. I mean, that is your forte after all. Your chariot awaits! I was walking on the shield time. See, all those silver little coin things pop out. I always think, is that me losing them or is that me gaining them? I mean, some of you guys might have answered in previous videos, but as of recording this, the first video hasn't even gone live yet, so... Who knows? But it always, it, to me, it looks like it's Sonic, like when you, when you get hurt and you lose your coins. That's what it looks like to me. Yeah, stop giving me the old stink eye, Jarvis. <laughs> I'll have you right as rain in no time. Oh, wait. Beating me up with a cutscene again? That is just cheap. <laughs> I 
your fire was inferior compared to mine. Right, anybody else want to try some of that? <laughs> hey, it's this guy. What was his name? I forget what they called him now. Either way. <laughs> I forget what his name was in the movie now. Hmm, so I'm going to have to dispose of that first. Alright, Cap, you're up. Impressive building, Mr. Stark. Now that's what I call a view. The view which I'm uh, literally teetering my life on the edge for. Hmm. Oh, you boys want to play, dear? Fair enough. And the shield gets the job done, not necessarily as quick as uh, Iron Man Iron Man's cannons do but they get the job done none the same yeah Tony we really need to get you up and flying again That's <laughs> certainly one way of doing it. If you don't know how to turn it off, just jam stuff in, to, in it until it stops on its own. Someone's been taking the page out of the Hulk's book. Again, attacking during the cutscenes, you cowards! <laughs> Oh man, I think I actually like his original suit. What's this, the Mark 1, is it? <laughs> I think I prefer this suit compared to his other one. It's just something about it. It's just got it's just like got a heavier feel to it. It's a few, pure brute force over finesse. I don't know, I, I, like as like when well, I there, let me start that sentence again, Jesus. When I was younger, I used to always prefer like the stealthy characters, the ones who always had to like sneak their way in and I've been playing a few games recently where I've been those sort of characters, but as I'm getting older, I'm finding I just like the ones who just use pure brute strength and don't get themselves electrocuted. Captain Steve Rogers, at your service. <laughs> well, you're not my service. I thought I'd slide down just in case there was a collectible there. Clearly, big mistake. No, Cap! Stop it! Listen to your master! Damn it! <laughs> yeah, speaking of not liking finesse, yeah, recently I've just find I just like characters that just use pure brute force it's just I don't know, it's this might require some extra muscle power something about it I just find it so fun so used to trying to be gentle with things it's just <laughs> fun to, as Hulk would say to smash That doesn't necessarily surprise me as one system goes down, another one comes online. Contingency after contingency. What is it I'm aiming at? This little panel down here? Fair enough. I was going to aim at the gun itself, but I figure I'll, I'm guessing I have to hit its uh, control panel. I oh, think very much. I <laughs> don't think I didn't forget about you in there. And the toxic waste went everywhere. Ah, yeah, little Iron Man. Oh, I was about to say, I'll leave you to another day, but uh, it looks like I might still have to leave you to another day. Oh, I've never done this before. Ha! Look at that. Hidden walls. 
some tricks in games just never get old. <laughs> Hidden walls and beginner traps are one of them. Whoa! Speaking of beginner's traps, that one was just cheap. Although, I wonder if I can destroy this thing with a laser. Ha! You can. Nice one. Obviously, it's not going to help me with all the ones I've already passed, but... Oh, what's up, Jarvis? <laughs> Am I beating all your defences? Although, obviously, Tony, you don't want to get killed by your own defences. You might want to look into this once we're done, because if we can beat your defences, I'm sure other people can too. Daddy's home. Apologies, sir. My systems are being overridden. Wow, that is so cool. No time for that now. Oh, yeah. 